Uh, my name is Frank Wirtwein and I'm the director of the San Diego Supercomputer Center. I'm also a professor of physics and I'm a professor of data science at the University of California, San Diego. As a director of, of SDSC, I lead an institution with uh, the mission to translate innovation into practice. I look at VAST as being architecturally a very interesting product because it fits into multiple different ways that I think about science challenges and possible solutions. Is the uh, need to have large scale capacitors at um, uh, locations where, in the, where you have large data centers, large compute infrastructures, in order to do wide air network transfers. In my field, we will be producing exabytes of data per year. To move all the data around the world, uh, we need a terabit per second um, uh, network connectivity. The first project that we're doing with VAST is using VAST as the source for wide air network tra uh, traffic, where the challenge is that uh, in, in a few years, the LHC will produce an exabyte of data a year, and all of that data is moved around the world for processing. I think of it as a capacitor at the end side, capacitor at the source destination, in order to support 400 gigabit transfers that we can do today and longer term terabit per second transfers over transatlantic distances. I'm also interested in exploring a wide range of different kinds of application of VAST. One of the core pain points of a center like ours is the kind of parallel file system that you need in order to support HPC. And there are lots of pain points that VAST could vastly simplify so that we wouldn't have to force certain types of applications into the NVMe inside the nodes, but could provision larger arrays and not make people do workflows, but just let them access the, ge uh, the general uh, storage for the entire center and then use this across multiple HPC systems and have a central storage infrastructure across systems that are HPC focused, AI focused, testbed focused, and have one central storage infrastructure that does it all and allows us to do, in addition, interesting system designs.